Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. From athletic beginnings in high school to overcoming battles with incarceration, mm -hmm. our next guests have worked hard to change their lives and make an impact on their communities. Yes, using fitness as their basis, these men are helping others change their eating and workout habits, hoping to bring total body fitness mm -hmm. and healing to the world. Please welcome Greg McNeil and Point du Jour. Yes! yes. We got you. Thank you, thank you. Yes. That's just a real fancy I name, know. Point du Jour. Is it, is it French? It is, it is. Yes. <laughs> Is it real? I want to see some ID. It's a Absolutely, absolutely. I love it. I yes. love it. I love it. Um, how did jail become your reality? Like you yeah. went from being athletes in jail. How did that? What happened? Well, coming from high school, I was a two-sport athlete. Um, received a partial scholarship to go play junior college football. Mm -hmm. um, I did two years there, and I had a foot, a foot injury. So when I had that injury and I transferred to my four-year school, I was un unable to play sports anymore. Mm. So being from, you know, Irvington, New Jersey, and then moving to Union, New Jersey, I still had contacts back at home. So I had one foot in school, one foot on still the in the streets. Right, right. And then just kind of got mixed up in that and then yeah. ended up getting caught up in a conspiracy drug trafficking case. Oh, wow. And then I spent a year and a half in federal prison. Oh, wow. Yeah. What about you? A uh, similar situation. I didn't get injured, but I... I played college basketball as well, uh, number five NAA and NAIA, uh -huh. and I ended up um, getting caught up in a drug conspiracy. I uh, received a 25-year federal sentence. Oh, wow! My God. And got my whole conviction overturned, sentence vacated. You know. Oh, wow. praise God! Yeah, just yeah. a walking blessing. Yes, yeah. really, so. really. So, what was that that turning point? Because you guys could have easily taken this situation and said, "Man, woe is me. This is what my life is." But you mm -hmm. decided to turn it around. What was yeah. the turning point for each of you? I think it was a, 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 mind, a mind shift. So oftentimes, if you're stuck in a certain situation, like even from an impoverished state, when you, when you think poverty and you say, I'm poor, I'm broke, then that's the mindset mm -hmm. you're going to have. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I think mine was, once I changed my thought process, mm -hmm. I knew that I had to physically make the change. Because yes. you can always speak about making a change, but if you don't physically take that uh, mm -hmm. you know, next step, mm -hmm. then you'll yeah. be stuck where you are. Right, and, uh, right, right. Do you echo those thing. sentiments as well? I, I echo it exactly yeah. to the same point. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. So absolutely. how did you all team up? Like, how did this happen? Greg you're and on Greg. the straight and narrow now, and you're doing your thing. Well, how did you do that? long story short. Hey, y'all smell good. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> all right, go ahead. Long story short, we were working <laughs> at, a, uh, at a gym here in Atlanta, uh -huh. um, and that's where we met. Oh. What are y'all? This is he's not a scratch and sniff. Oh, oh sorry God. guys. That was just no. great. No. Go ahead. Okay, okay. All right, go ahead. Go ahead, Greg. Stay focused. Go ahead. I'm focused. Focus. I'm focused. Okay, I got this. Focus. Met at a gym in Atlanta. Met this brother. Got the same name, same background, same wow. everything. Wow. It was like I've met my brother from another mother. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then uh I went to bat for him because like he said, I had a I had a felony on my record, he had a felony on his, and then that's how I was able to work through corporate to get him on the job at the time okay um because you know they didn't want to hire you because you're a felon you got to yeah. check the box right so and it, once we built that relationship a working relationship then eventually it grew into now a 10-year business relationship and brotherhood yeah awesome. Awesome. awesome i love that's that good. So you know I see God in everything. Yes, come on. So when you pull your, when when He said, you know, when you get your mind together, you can talk a lot. Mm -hmm. But when you move into getting your life together, I just believe that God m moves all the all the pieces together for your life. Yes. And yes. now you found each other. You said it was a brother from another mother, and you wrote a book. Yes. What yes. made you write the book together? Yes. Well, <clears throat> The book came about. Oh, this is an amazing cover. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Look at how you're walking like you're walking, sir. They got these suits. They got these nice bags and satchels. I'm here for it. Go ahead, though. Stay focused. Stay focused. What brought the book about? Are you single? No. Oh, God. Don't try to stay focused. Stay focused, please. What was the brought? What brought the book about was just the need to change change the stereotype. Yeah. We're not drinking lean, mm -hmm. popping yes. molly or anything right. like that. We're right. young, young men. I come from Chicago, so everyone knows how Chicago is. So yeah. I, we just wanted to lead by example, mm -hmm. show them something different. Praise God. So that was why we brought forth the, uh, the book, mm -hmm. and we wanted to show them that. Even okay. going through some hardship, you can become entrepreneurs yes, and change your, change your life completely. Yeah. Yes. Yes. So, so would you say that's one of the major takeaways, or what do you want your readers to take away from the book? Point du jour. Um, to me, it's a self-empowerment book. 
you know, the name of it is Background Check, Seven Keys to Unlocking Success in Life and Business. So when you get into this book, it's talking about life, it's talking about entrepreneurship, but then also after every chapter, it has tasks. So mm. you have to tap in and figure out what's my purpose, what's my vision, how do I get to this next level? Mm -hmm. So we basically put all of those different pieces in one book to kind of transform the reader to get from where you are right now to where you want to be in wow. life and in business. I That's like good. that. That's okay. good. So if, if they follow the steps. They yeah. If they follow they the steps. Right. Get, we give you the keys now. If you don't want to go open that door, then that's on you. Right. Yeah, the man told y'all. Okay. Right. So now we have hybrid impact fitness and hybrid fit food. We opened, That's the gym. we opened the gym 10 years ago, just wanted to change lives one day at a time. Okay. And it mm -hmm. ended up growing into Lexi, something else. Lexi, you see else. that picture, Lexi? Did you catch that picture? <laughs> so I know you were looking at the picture, so I, you were looking at the man. I'm asking you to look at the Go back to the picture. That's somebody's petty in the program room. Oh, oh my God. Oh so go ahead. It, it ended up growing into um, nutrition because we had a lot of clients that, that they actually did the actual exercise, yes. but they didn't understand the importance of nutrition. No, right. they did. So we incorporated the restaurant hybrid fit food okay. to give them a twofold, and now we're working on a, another one that we're actually going to um, build and now doing a partnership okay. in Decatur, Georgia. Right Come on, now, awesome, awesome, there. that's fantastic. Well, stay focused, Greg don't, don't and look to the right, so don't look fantastic. to the right, just stay focused. <laughs> everyone, everyone, focus. everyone. Greg McNeil. Greg Point du Jour, we are yeah. very happy We're for so you. I'm so proud of you guys. I'm so yeah. proud. I've never been more proud. Yeah. Oh my. Please go over, head to their website, backgroundcheckthebook.com. Give it up for these amazing men. Thank you, thank you, thank you for having me. That's right.